It's buzzing in here ahead of game three. And we'll be back in a minute to get it started. Live from the north side of Chicago, Wrigley Field, MLB The Show brings you the National League Championship Series. The Atlanta Braves and the Chicago Cubs. John Shambi, Chris Singleton with you. A lot going on in this series as we get ready for game three, Singy. And Boog, this is as close to an elimination game as you can get without it actually being one. Going down 3-0 would more or less just end this thing. So this game's going to tell us whether we're going to have a real series in store for us or if we're just going to be packing our bags and going home. A lot of people feel Yo, these teams are more evenly Chicago. matched the first two games would indicate. So we'll see if we get a bounce back performance in this one. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. On the north side of Chicago, John Chambi and Chris Singleton. Now it's the power speed combo. King Tejada. Well, all eyes on the double play ball in this spot. No better way to get out of this inning. The 1-0. This to center field. Grisham settles under it. And there's two away. Batter for the catcher, Sean Murphy. Now the left fielder, Nick Plummer. The left fielder, Nick Plummer. Hey, put him away here. Out to short, Tejada. To first, and that is that. Two left on. We head on now to the top of the third. It's the Braves four and the Cubs nothing. Welcome back. New inning getting started. Stepping in the long ball threat, King Tejada. He is quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports, too. Tejeda, in his fifth season, 22 years old, and he's a former Silver Slugger recipient in the National League. Found back our way, and that's out of play. You know, we talk so much about how guys prepare for a start. For Giolito, one of the things that's really cool, he actually uses scouting reports and then plays MLB the show to execute how he's going to go about attacking hitters. Grisham makes the catch, and there's one down. Dansby Swanson's turned into one of the best defensive shortstops in baseball, Chris, and a lot of the help came from Ron Washington, but Dansby put in the work. Out to short, Tejada. Throws to first, and Swanson is set down. Up next to the Cubs, the designated hitter, Pete Armstrong. And now Seiya Suzuki right went down on strikes his first time through. Suzuki. And the righty deals. Chopped out in front of the plate. Goes to second for one. Not in time at first. It's a fielder's choice. On the north side of Chicago, John Chambi and Chris Singleton. And next will be the cleanup hitter, King Tejada. He's not going to get cheated up there. No, he's not. He's looking to do damage with every swing he takes. And a foul ball. Acuna off of first with two away. Swing and a line drive, base hit out of the center field. Up next for Atlanta, the catcher. Sean First and second, two Murphy. down. Here's the catcher, Sean Murphy. One for two. Two outs. That one missed. Not the easiest thing 
when you're talking about a guy that's, you know, perhaps is going to be in the rotation, you know, maybe a long relief guy to not start an inning, to come into an inning with pressure on it and, and try to get yourself comfortable. Swing and a miss. The Cubs bullpen with some action. Tanner Bybee up and loosening in the pen. Assad getting loose as well. And a pop-up, right side, foul territory. Reaches for it, but it's foul. Next one misses, and the count's full. Austin Riley on deck for Atlanta. Two outs, a couple of base runners at first and second. Foul ball, and it remains a full count. Right-handed reliever. Foul. We'll see another payoff pitch. That's ripped. Base hit. Runner from second scores as they add on. And the lead is up to five. The tag, and that's out number three, inning over. One run, a pair of hits, no errors. And one left on. Home half of the fifth. On the north side of Chicago, John Chambi and Chris Singleton. Now it's going to be King Tejada. Hey, get your pitch up there. Come on now. Hammer, base hit. Smith coming home. He'll score easily. And it's now a six run lead. A couple of hits in a row for him here. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity. Right on top of it. So two on with two away. And now the catcher comes up to hit. Sean Murphy. Really good piece of hitting last time. Going to the opposite field. That one misses. Ball two. And the pitch. And yeah, that's too high. Action in the pen down there. Raylan Marquez, the left handed reliever, appears to be getting loose. Thompson, the right hander, also getting loose. First and second, two down. And there's ball four. Well, a breaking ball in that 3-2 count kind of tells you that that's the pitch he has the most confidence in right now. Just couldn't find the strike zone. Base is full, two gone. Here's Austin Riley. Singing, you can't ask for anything more. This guy checks all the boxes offensively. He's the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start at game time. It starts in the afternoon the way he prepares and gets ready. Well, got to pause on that thought as that'll do it for the inning. So they get one, but end up leaving the bases loaded. Seventh inning stretch time. Braves six, and the Cubs nothing. On the north side of Chicago, John Chambi and Chris Singleton. Now it's the shortstop, King Tejada. Oh, now. Popped up, foul territory behind the plate. Kirk makes the grab, and there's two gone. So first and second with two outs. Christopher Morell, the next Cub to hit. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Bounced out to short, Tejada. On to first, ball game. And the Braves lead this series three games to none and have a chance to complete the sweep here tomorrow. These guys have been truly dominant in the series. Up now three games to none. 
pretty demoralizing on the other side. You want to get this thing over as quickly as possible. So stay focused, come back for the next game, and close out this series. Eight to the final here for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon.